Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a review and demo and giveaway of the new Becca Jaclyn Hill palette. So she actually released this item early before the release date and I was able to pick it up. And so I thought it would be really great to share it with you guys in case you were thinking about getting it, thinking about picking it up. So yeah, along with that I'm also going to be doing a giveaway because this palette is $52 so it is very pricey and if you guys really wanted it and couldn't get your hands on it, I wanted to give you the opportunity to do so. So anyways, I will leave all that information linked down below, but I love you guys. If you're not subscribed, make sure to click the subscribe button down below and let's go ahead and get into my thoughts review tutorial on the palette because I don't know if you see this glow but it came from this palette so I'm really excited to show it to you guys okay so I'm going to go ahead and like show you guys how the palette looks so here is the front of the palette and as you can see it says Becca and Jaclyn Hill and it's beautiful it's gold packaging with white in the center with little flakes around it then the back side has Jaclyn Hill on it so here is what the back side looks like and it just talks a little bit about the palette and has her signature and photo on it as well. Ooh, let me go ahead and take the plastic off. So here's what it looks like when you open it up. And I'll give you guys a close up. This packaging is like absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Oh, it's so pretty. So here is what the actual palette looks like. It looks just like the packaging except it has gold and silver flakes on it. And then on the back it just kind of shows you like what all of the colors are. So when you open it up, <laughs> okay, it has the little plastic piece that says the different colors. This is what the palette itself looks like. So you have three blushes at the top, two highlights on the bottom. And what I really like is they did put Becca and Jacqueline right here at the bottom, which I think is really nice. And look how big this mirror is. It's like massive. I mean, I could do my everyday makeup in this mirror. So let's go ahead and try on the palette and then I'll kind of give you guys my review. We'll do some comparisons with the sizes of these different blushes and highlighters. Okay, so if you guys did not get Champagne Pop, that was the first highlighter that Jaclyn came out with last year. And it is this one right here in this palette. Oh my gosh, I just love these highlights from Becca. So there's what Champagne Pop looks like. And then I'll go ahead and show you guys what the new highlight looks like. It is called Prosecco Pop, I believe. So this one's more of a gold highlight. Oh yeah, holy cow. I mean, look at that. That's like barely even picking up a lot of product. And I mean, do you guys see this? I'm gonna do one more swipe. I mean, honestly, like, I always love her highlights. I just feel like Jacqueline is just such like a highlight person that every product that she creates, especially if it has a glow in it, I just feel like it's perfect. So as you can see, this one right here is the Prosecco Pop. And then this one right here is Champagne Pop, which you guys could probably see a lot of swatches of this online since it has been released for a while. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the middle shade right here, the blush, and it is called Amaretto. And I'm just going to pop that in between my highlight and my bronzer. This is kind of like how I've been doing everything recently. And I'm going to go in and kind of blend this all out. Oh my gosh, look at this highlight. Okay, so that's the demo. Let's go ahead and get into the review part. Okay, so like I said, the packaging is absolutely stunning. I did actually hear a lot of people say that the highlighters are full size, so I want to go ahead and compare those first off. This is sold exclusively at Sephora, and what they did, and the reason I actually got it early, is because Jaclyn Hill had a like launch party basically in New York, and it was not supposed to release until the 26th of May, along with a lot of other products that are going to be in the collection. However, she made an announcement on her snapchat that they were going to go live on the sephora.com app and I'm pretty sure they sold out in I think it was like less than two hours like it was super soon so literally as soon as I saw that it went live I 
checked out within like three minutes as soon as I saw her Snapchat. So anyways, this is a limited edition, so I just want to go ahead and throw that out there since we're talking about it. The palette itself retails for $52, and you are, like I said, you're getting two highlights, and you are getting three blushes. So let's go ahead and compare these as far as the size-wise, because they are not the same exact size as her actual highlighters. So as you can see, kind of put these side by side, um, this is what her actual highlighter typically looks like right here. And then here are the ones in the palette. So not, you know, a huge difference, but still this is a lot bigger than the two highlighters in the palette. And then for blushes, this is one of her blushes. This is called Songbird. And I'll go ahead and show you guys with it kind of up close to the blushes right here. So as you can see, you know, it's not the same size, but it is still a fairly big size. So now that we've talked about all that, let's go ahead and swatch this baby. I'm really excited. So you have two highlights here at the bottom and then you have three different blushes. And what I really like that she said that she did with the blushes is she did one of like every finish. Okay, let's go ahead and swatch it. So first we're going to do swatches of the blushes. Okay, so here are the three kind of swatched on my finger. This is the darkest one. This is the middle one and this right here is the shimmer one. And honestly, this one right here kind of reminds me a lot of the new finishes that Becca just put out. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. These are fully living up to my expectations of them. Oh, look at those. Okay, so there are the three blush shades. As you can see, they are gorgeous. And then the two on the outside, I feel like would even look good together. Like you could put the pinker color on your cheeks and then top it off with the shimmery pink right there. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. I'm so excited I got this palette. Like y'all already kind of know my review because that's how excited I am. Okay, let's go ahead and swatch the highlighters. Okay, so this one right here is going to be Champagne Pop. This one right here is going to be Prosecco Pop. As you can see, I mean, they are just absolutely stunning. The Champagne, of course, has more of like, I would say like a pink undertone. Honestly, I wasn't expecting the Prosecco Pop to be as gold. It's very, very gold. It reminds me of Old Darling by MAC. Let me go ahead and just swatch this. I mean, let's just see if it's a dupe. Mm, I mean, kind of. That's the like limited edition highlighter that like sold out um, at MAC. Sorry, I just like got really excited and wanted to swatch that. So there's what those three look like. Obviously the two on this side are Becca. Look how pretty. <laughs> you guys know like when I like something, I just get so excited. So let's break down the pros and cons. So first off, the packaging is absolutely gorgeous. I love, love, love it. As always, I always feel like she has such great taste whenever she does collaborations. I just feel like they are very her, so I really, really like it. The next thing is it has a humongous mirror, so if you did travel with it, then you'd be good to go to use this whole palette on your face because the mirror is great. Another really great thing about this palette is the colors are absolutely gorgeous in my opinion. I personally really like how they look on my skin tone, and I really think I'll get a lot of wear out of this palette just because it's very summer appropriate. I really like all of the colors, and oh my gosh, this one totally reminds me of her new blushes. So I really, really like it. It is the same formula, obviously, as her blushes and her highlighters. So you are getting like the great Becca formula because they are known for their highlighters and I personally love their blushes. So I'm really, really happy about that. And the formula is very smooth and it glides on great, very pigmented, and there's not like a lot of fallout. It's not very powdery. So plus, plus, plus for me. Oh, and another plus is that you're getting three different finishes with the blushes because I know some people like prefer matte or some people prefer shimmer. So you're getting to try out like three different finishes for your blushes. So I think that's really great because you do get a variety in case you don't like a matte blush or whatever it may be. And then for cons, this is a con for me. I do not like the mirror packaging. I think it's beautiful, but it's not beautiful when I have like 1200 fingerprints on it, as you guys can see right here. I mean, it just kind of like looks messy and I'm like really picky about how my makeup looks and I hate fingerprints being on everything. So that of course is going to be one con for me. Another thing, and this could be a pro or con, just like however you look at it, 
but you are getting champagne pop in this palette so this is a repeat color and for me I already have champagne pop so it's kind of like not as exciting because most people like if you don't have it then you're getting to try out five different like shades you get three blushes two highlighters but you do already have a shade that may be in your collection which is kind of like a con in my opinion another thing is that it's $52 now I don't think that's a bad price for what all you're getting but you know like Jacqueline has a ton of supporters she has 3 million followers on YouTube and for me like that's a big price point especially like if you have girls that are in high school or just getting out of high school like working you know their first job you know that's a lot to come out of pocket on whenever you're trying to you know support somebody that you really love I honestly thought that it was worth the money but I'm just saying you know as far as a con it is $52 so it just depends on what your budget is and then the last con for me would be like your skin tone so let's say that you're super super fair and I'm not very fair so I'm just speaking from what I have heard you know I feel like this gold would be almost like too dark on your skin I think it's a beautiful color and I really like it you know on my skin because I'm kind of tan but I feel like it could be very overpowering if you are very fair and then the darkest pink um, you know it could be kind of really dark on your skin because it is like super duper pigmented so yeah, those are the pros and cons of the palette. And as far as my opinion on the palette, if you're wanting to know if I would suggest you picking it up, absolutely. The thing is, is that whenever Jaclyn Hill comes out with an item, it always like sells out extremely fast. So her Champagne Pop, it was supposed to be limited edition and it sold out and sold out and sold out. And anyways, they ended up making it permanent. So I would say if you want to get your hands on this to go ahead and get it because the last thing you want to do is regret not picking it up and it is a really good value for what you're getting. I mean you're getting five products. They are Becca products so if you have been wanting to try out Becca products I would highly recommend picking this up because like I said it is the same formula and everything else as her other blushes and highlighters and those kind of things. So I would absolutely 100% recommend it. I'm really glad I got it. I like don't think I've been so excited about a product in a really long time and it's kind of like thicker so I don't know if I would travel with it but I like almost love it so much that I want to take it on vacation with me. So yeah, let me know down below if you guys are going to get it. I'll put the link down below for you guys as well of where you can pick it up. But I'm really excited that I got it and I think I'm going to be wearing it a lot. I mean, this color, I mean, it's like a wet glow. So the colors are absolutely beautiful in the palette. And yeah, that's all I have to say. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure down below that you don't forget to enter the giveaway. I will leave the link down below in the description bar for you guys. And I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye.